All right, here we are. Okay, guys, let's sit back and watch. Nintendo Direct 9 4 2019. Oh, it's Overwatch. Holy crap. Overwatch is on Switch. Holy shit. Oh, nice. Motion controls. Oh, wow. Awesome. Glorious. Nice. I'm not quite sure if I want to get that, though. I need to save my money for better games anyway. Comes October. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna buy it. Hello everyone, I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. I'm Shinya Takahashi. And that was, of course, the latest trailer for Overwatch by Blizzard Entertainment. The game no is scheduled for release on Nintendo Switch October 15th, so please look forward to it. Uh, okay, I think I'll pass. let's get into our first batch of Nintendo Switch headlines. Please take a look. Yeah, it's just Nintendo Switch only. You gotta see these floors of the hotel for yourself. Hmm. Luigi's Ooh, Mansion Ooh, this is a game I'm definitely gonna get. Hotel, where hmm. every floor has a distinct theme unlike any other. Case in point, hmm. Tomb Suites. I mean, a pyramid inside a hotel? Guess we should expect some mummies, harsh sands, and booby traps. As oh, for the Jesus. other floors, well, there's a disco floor, I know. Restaurant. Cute. You get the idea. Hmm. May not be the usual amenities, but there's a rogues gallery of bosses to check out before you, well, check out. Speaking of amenities, step right up to this all new attraction, Screen Park. In this party mode, there's a Luigi team and a Gooigi team. With only one oh, Nintendo wow. Switch system, Cute. two to eight players can battle it out. See which team can defeat the most ghosts. Collect the most coins by piloting floaties with the Poltergeist G00. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't do this, please. Come on. Can we just watch the fucking video? I mean, come on. This is bullshit. God damn it. Uh, why does this have to happen? No. I'm sorry, guys. Hang on a second. Come on. Can't Collectively, you and your... Wow, what the fuck just happened? No, 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 no. Oh, come on, you piece of shit. I just want to watch the direct. Fuck. Hang on a second, guys. Uh, this is so frustrating. One system. Team up via local wireless. We just missed or a lot. Ah. Uh. It'll be time to unite with friends and players from around the world and overcome each challenging quest when Super Kirby Clash launches later today. Oh, wow. And remember, awesome. It's free to start, too. Oh, it's free to start. Excellent. This long awaited, recently released RPG is getting a remake. Hmm. After 25 years, fans of the Mana series can look forward to the HD remake of the third game in the trilogy, Trials of Mana. Okay, don't hiccup on me, Six Nintendo. I, I want to watch the stupid choose thing. choose a protagonist and two companions. The ones you choose will determine which of the interwoven stories you'll follow through this reimagined world. Now you remember what will happen to dear Jessica if I die. This interference will not be forgotten. As each character advances, they'll have the opportunity to switch their class, allowing them to learn stronger special moves and spells. Step into the light or show your dark side when picking your class to change your character's appearance and abilities. 
Unlike the classic version, characters have full range of movement, including jumping and combo attacks for each member of your party. Why does it do that? I don't get that. Once again, the wheels of fate are beginning to turn. Find out what's in- God fucking damn it, I hate it when this happens, it's so embarrassing. Oh, come on. Can't we just watch our direct without these stupid issues? Jesus fucking Christ, this is ridiculous. Hang on a second. Uh, it's so hard to refresh on OBS though. This is not fair. I'm trying to watch- On one less than ordinary device. Use the power of the Momentum Mortem Pocket Watch to turn back time and witness each soul's last moment. You bastards may take exactly what I give you! Explore the ship, observe the situation, and record your logical deductions. Without you, the true tale will never It's be not a pun to refresh, but it's really embarrassing what when I'm trying to stream this with you guys. Little by little, tease apart the misfortunes of the ship and its crew to solve the mystery. Return of the Oberdin arrives on Nintendo Switch in Fall 2019. There's a small town out there with a big secret. Never oh, leave cute. town. Hmm. That is the rule agreed upon by the people of this peaceful town and the castle protecting it. One day, there suddenly appeared a giant monster. To defend the townspeople, one boy named Axe will stand up to face it. And the only weapons he'll need are ideas. But to win one of these battles, you must know when to use them. Strategy is everything if there's any hope to win. During battle, you can move around to garner support from townspeople. Take advantage to gain the advantage. Seize every opportunity to protect your town in this new RPG from Game Freak. No thanks. And almost all the music in the game was composed by Undertale creator Toby Fox. Oh wow, nice. Little Town Hero will make a stand on Nintendo Switch October 16th. You eh, can I'll pass. purchase and preload the game later today. Fall is coming to Super Smash Bros. Yes! Ultimate. Just what I wanted, baby! We can finally confirm mm. the release date of mm. Challenger Pack 3, Banjo and Kazooie. Yes! Banjo and Kazooie. Woo! <laughs> and the release date is... Today. Oh! After He's out today! Event, we'll Woo! broadcast a video detailing how to use Banjo and Kazooie. <laughs> Featuring the game's director, Masahiro Sakura. Wow! As a special I can't treat, believe he's out today. immediately Woo! following the Nintendo Direct you're watching right now. Well, I'm definitely gonna fucking play as him today. Until the release of Banjo and Kazooie, please check it out. Oh, yes. Woo! First, that got me excited. What, what's, what's, what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Uh, what the hell is going on? What the fuck? Oh no. Oh. Someone from SNK is coming in. Shit, I guess the rumor was true after all. Honestly, I don't know who this is. I'm not gonna really care either way. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, 
I don't know who it's going to be, but I feel like it's going to be like a waste of a, of a character slot. That's just me, though. Don't mind me, guys. Oh, so, who's it going to be? Hey, come on! Terry Faces the Fury. Now in development. I don't know what to what to think about that, guys. It's not really a character I'm kind of interested, not really interested in anyway. If anything, just put Show Night and Smash, and I'll be happy. So, Terry Bogard from Fatal Fury is joining the battle. That means we've revealed four of the five fighters included in the Fighters Pass. Can there really be only one left? There better not be just one. I want Show Night playable, damn it. We're yes! happy to confirm that the number of more DLC fighters Booyah! for Super Smash Brothers. That's Ultimate. what I'm talking about. Yeah! Outside the five fighters Woo! included in the fighters pass. We can confirm that other new fighters are in development. Yes! The battle isn't over yet. Please put Show Night in Smash, damn it! Grr! So, what do you think? Regarding what was announced about additional fighters at the end of that segment, we'll have more to share with you in the future. For now, let's continue with some more Nintendo Switch headlines. Just give me Shemonite, fucking damn it! Uh, I just want Shemonite Smash. It's about time to wake the wind fish. Yeah, the hell yeah, Shemonite awesome. You better believe it. Means the next big adventure Aww, on Nintendo cute. Switch is fast approaching. You'll meet some strangely endearing islanders. Face a series of puzzling tasks and encounter some oddly familiar faces. Whatever Aww, happens, that's cute. help Link escape Koholint Island before its mysteries get the mm. best of him. Mm. With the all-new Chamber Dungeon, you can place chambers earned on your adventure mm. to arrange your own dungeons, mm. add in plus effects that alter chambers, mm. and save Chamber Dungeons to a compatible amiibo figure featuring a character from the Legend of Zelda series. That way, your friends can play that, it. That, that, that amiibo looks really cute. That looks really cute. Zelda, I love Link's it. Link's Awakening will launch before you know it on September 20th. The new Link amiibo figure will be available that same day. Aw, oh, man. I got so many Zelda amiibo to collect you now. You the hero's might from Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Now join his adventure. Dragon Quest XI-S, Echoes of an Elusive Age Definitive Edition is exactly that. The most complete version of a sprawling adventure story that allows you to choose between HD and 2D graphics. Travel to past Dragon Quest worlds. And experience new character focused stories. The day the game launches, free downloadable content can be found in the Champions Pack, including consumable items and more equipment that can change the appearance of party members. An RPG giant draws near. Dragon Quest 11 S Echoes. I'm definitely gonna stream this. I'm definitely gonna stream this. Journeys onto Nintendo Switch September 27th. Booyah! Oh great, there goes the fucking Until hiccups then, again. You can prepare for your adventure with the free demo on Nintendo eShop. Looking for more Fire Emblem oh, goodness? Oh! Yes! Say hello to Tokyo! Booyah! This game is actually on, on Switch the now! The Fire Emblem series and Atlas mm. games have crossed paths, and the result is coming to Nintendo Switch. Mm. Wow! I knew this would happen! In modern day Tokyo, where creative energy is so abundant, it's materialized into something called Performa, which attracts wicked mirages who suck it out of people. You'll face off against this threat as up-and-comer Itsuki Aoi and his friends who are trying to make it in the entertainment business. Fire Emblem characters like Prom and Sita will join you from another dimension. Together, you'll wage deep turn-based battles, blending the combat of the Fire Emblem and Shin Megami Tensei series. And, in the Nintendo Switch That's version, cute. there's a new song that wasn't included in the original. Be sure to check out the other new features, from the new story elements to the characters joining you in battle for the first time. Hey, is that Tiki? Tokyo Mirage Sessions Sharp FE Encore releases on January 17th. You can pre-purchase the game later today. Ah, uh, I have to wait. I have to wait for that though, unfortunately. Welcome back to where nothing is what it seems. Boston, 2019.
It all begins again when FBI agent yeah, Aaliyah Davis opens an investigation into an old fact, serial killer she... case. She also opens a door to the unknown, a door that also takes us back to New Orleans 14 years oh. ago. Me? Here, our story follows an FBI agent who goes by the name of York. Exactly. Like the journey between past and present will take Aaliyah and York on a winding path. But what lies at the end? Will it be truth or madness? Deadly Premonition 2, a blessing in disguise, bottles no, and beguiles on Nintendo Switch nope. in 2020. Not getting that. And now for a shocker. The original game in the series will launch a Nintendo eShop at Deadly Premonition Origins later today. No thanks. Divinity Original Sin 2 Definitive Edition is finally coming to Nintendo Switch. Check it out. Yeah. And now for a message from Bethesda. Hey Nintendo fans, Pete Hines from Bethesda. On behalf of everyone at id Software, I'm excited to announce something really cool that we have coming to Nintendo Switch later this year. I'm sure many of you have fond memories of spending countless hours playing your favorite games on Nintendo 64. Well, this year is the 25th anniversary of Doom, one of the most popular first person shooter franchises ever. And to celebrate, we're re-releasing one of our favorite games, Doom 64. For the first time since its original release in 1997, Doom 64 will be officially available on yep. a Nintendo console. We live your crusade against the demons in more than 30 action-packed levels. Or if you're a newcomer, experience the retro first-person shooter that helped make Doom one of the most popular shooter franchises in history. Doom 64 will release on Nintendo Switch on November 22nd this year. Oh, wow. Jesus Christ, so many games to buy. Holy crap. Introducing a brand new IP from developer High Res Studios, Rogue Company. To no most thanks. Of the world, Rogue Company is a rumor at best, but its operatives are the real deal. Nah. And as one of these elite specialists, you'll face challenges which will require your specialized abilities and tools to combat the infamous organization Jackal. Play against friends or match up with a similarly skilled team online in a variety of objective based game modes. Whether you wield guns, gadgets, or melee weapons, your playstyle will depend on your choice of mercenary, which can be fully customized. There will be plenty of modes, maps, weapons, skins, in-game events, and more. When Rogue Company sneaks up on Nintendo Switch in 2020. Hmm. How's it going? Next, the new titles in the core Pokemon RPG series, Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. We have more information to share that will shed new light on this next Pokemon adventure. Please take a look. Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield take place in the Gala region, a scenic land where people and Pokemon work together toward a prosperous future. Among them, you'll encounter new Pokemon and meet new people throughout your adventure. Today, we'll cover four features you can look forward to. First, customizing your look. Once again, the latest entry in the series lets you pick your outfit. This time, it's not just tops and bottoms, but a wide variety, including outerwear and oh, gloves. Nice. nice. Plus, you can change your hairstyle. Cute. 
or put on a That's little That's adorable, makeup. really. That's really cute. There's a lot really more cute. to becoming a champion than simply honing your battle skills. You've got to look That's the part, too, don't you think? Cute. That's really adorable. Second, I like that. Pokemon Camp. During your journey through the Galar region, you can camp anytime at Pokemon Camp. Aww, cute. While you're there, you can play with your Pokemon. And as you get to know them better, they'll also improve in battle. Additionally, in the wild area, you can visit other players' camps too. Feel free to bring along one of your Pokemon and hang out with up to three other players at the camp. Nice. We definitely recommend interacting with another player's Pokemon. Third, curry on rice. Pokemon Camp is also a great place to cook up a dish that is very popular in the Gala region. Curry on rice. How your curry turns out and what type it is ultimately depends on which berries and other ingredients you use. Not to mention the heart you put into it. There are more than 100 types. And each one you cook up will be registered in your curry decks. The goal? To master the art of curry. Huh? What's mm. that Pokemon doing here? And fourth, we'll introduce some new Pokemon discovered in the Gala region. First is Poltegeist. Normally, it makes a home for itself by hiding amongst tableware at hotels and restaurants. Its body is made of tea, complete with its own aroma and flavor. It may even allow a trusting trainer to taste its tea. This ghost-type Pokémon also has a special ability called Weak Armor. Next, another new Pokémon called Cramorant. Oh, that's this flying cute. and water-type Pokémon has one huge appetite. It will swallow anything it can fit in its mouth. When it uses Surf or Dive during battle, oh, it's a water-type Pokémon. It rises from the water, along with the catch in its mouth. If it takes damage in this state, it'll retaliate by spitting out its catch at the attacker. This is Cramorant's exclusive new ability, Gulp Missile. Huh, cute. And that's all we have to share with you today. Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield will launch on Nintendo Switch November 15th. I'm not quite sure if I want to get that, though. Well, how about that? There are still two more months until the game releases. Please look forward to the day you can start your new adventure in the Galar region. So, it's been about a year since we began offering Nintendo Switch Online memberships. With Nintendo Switch Online, we're providing a variety of games and fun features. Mm -hmm. And now, we're looking to add in an additional library of games. It's called Ooh, Super yeah. Nintendo Entertainment Super Nintendo, System baby. Nintendo Switch Woo! Online. With this, you can play a variety of classic Super NES games on Nintendo Switch. Oh yeah, definitely. There are some you may not expect, like Stunt Race FX, which will be available to play on another system for the first time. All right, you nice. You can face off or team up in local multiplayer by passing a Joy-Con controller to a friend, or even play together online. Oh. And the rewind function will be available from launch. Excellent. Here are the first games we plan to release. Awesome, they got Star Fox. As long as they have Star Fox and Zelda All Metroid. All the games you see on screen will launch tomorrow. All right, okay, yeah, sure, of I'll course, take it. We will eventually add more to the lineup. Okay. This offer is exclusively available to Nintendo Switch Online members, so please enjoy them at no additional charge. Thank you. Oh, you noticed this, did you? Yes. To recapture the original feel of these games, we will be releasing a Super Nintendo Entertainment System Nintendo Switch Online exclusive controller as a special offer.